It's a phrase on our coins and in some public buildings. Now there's debate over in God we trust signs on display in Texas public schools, yeah, including a number of signs here in the Houston area. A new state law, in case you hadn't heard, makes displaying the signs mandatory if the signs are donated. Jason Miles live at a school in SciFair ISD tonight where one of the signs recently went up. Jason. Hey there guys, yeah, this is Charles Goodson Middle School behind me, one of nearly a dozen schools that have gotten one of the signs so far, but it's something that doesn't sit well with everyone. Signs for backpacks and volleyball camp are on display outside Goodson Middle School, but it's this new sign inside that's getting attention. We just felt like it was um, a great opportunity to display our national motto in our public schools. Texas State Representative Dr. Tom Oliverson of Houston co-authored a bill that recently became law, making it mandatory for a school to display in God we trust signs like these if they're privately donated, like a batch given to Carroll ISD near DFW just last night. This was a idea uh, that I had after seeing something similar happen in a couple of different states. The Yellow Rose of Texas Republican women posted a number of photos on Facebook showing framed signs volunteers made before donating them to a number of Sci Fair area schools, including Goodson. The district added in a statement, quote, as part of the national motto program, the Yellow Rose of Texas Republican women are generously donating a copy to every instructional facility in Sci Fair ISD. It's a disgrace. Sci Fair parent Allie Fitzpatrick is among those fired up. These groups are hijacking our public education. Oliverson says most of the feedback he's gotten has been extremely positive, but there are definite signs not everyone is on board. I think it reminds us uh, that we are a nation that believes in a power greater than ourselves. Well, the point is, is that we are America and not everyone does believe in the same God. So telling children that is very confusing. And Representative Oliverson says he's checked in with uh, various faith leaders from the community after the passage of this measure. They seem to support the signs and that God doesn't necessarily have to mean the same thing to everyone. Reporting live from Cyprus, Jason Miles, KHOU 11 News. Lynn.